Supine pretzel stretch. So lying on your back in a supine position, chin tuck, ribcage starts on top of the pelvis, soles of the feet in contact with the floor. You're going to place one ankle across your knee. From that position, using the ankle across the knee as well as a bit of a guide, you're going to roll the weight bearing leg into internal rotation, trying to almost get the inside of the knee in contact with the floor best you can without getting it pinching through the pelvis. Your upper torso stays in contact with the floor as you do this, but your lower back can roll with the knee. So you're coming into internal rotation, that means that foot's gonna roll onto the inside of the foot, come back to the center position, big deep breath in, then repeat again, exhale as you roll in and out, repeat for the prescribed number of repetitions on one side before changing sides. So again, we're working on that hip internal rotation. Vital thing if you're gonna be moving sideways, good hip internal rotation that's a supine pretzel stretch